Hey everyone, welcome to an overview of SkillCat's new simulation to assess electrical aptitude of anyone who applies for a role in the HVAC realm. Um, so this specific simulation is going to go over how to use a multimeter at a very basic level, but it'll be a great way to screen anyone who applies for a position as an HVAC technician um, or other basic roles within the HVAC industry. So let's dive in. Cool, so we've broken the simulation down into four separate categories. The first is just teaching people how to insert the probes into the correct port of the multimeter. The second is showing people how to use the dial and dial it into the correct zone in order to measure what you want. Um, and the third one, we're gonna use the probes to basically measure and set up the multimeter so that you can actually get a voltage measurement across a battery. And then the fourth one, we're basically gonna do some troubleshooting and see why the multimeter was overloaded. So let's dive in. And the first one, again, very basic, but we're gonna start off with making sure people know how to connect the proper, uh, probe into the connector, right? And so we're gonna take this black probe, drop it into the COM port, and then we're gonna move on to the next one, right? And the next one, we're gonna take the red connector, drop it into the proper port, right? And so that's really the first simulation, super basic, uh, but you're gonna see that these simulations start stacking on top of each other to really test someone's knowledge, right? And so now we're gonna go on to the next one. And so in this one, all we're doing is really setting the dial to the proper section to measure voltage. Right. And so all of these simulations right now have our education mode built into it, where it's providing guidance and instruction on what to do. We also have an assessment mode where basically all of these instructions are going to go away and just very high level goals are going to be given to them to really test how well they can use a multimeter. And so that's how it'll be used more in a job context of screening candidates to see if they can use a multimeter when they actually get out into the field. All right, so now let's go to the next one. This one, again, super basic. We're basically just gonna set up the probes at each end of a battery uh, to take a voltage measurement. Cool. So that's really all there is to that one. And this next one will give you a better example of what an assessment might look like. So obviously when we set up this circuit last time, we ended up with an overload. Um, and so you can see all we say in this one is let's see how to resolve the overload issue that we saw earlier, right? And so a technician who doesn't know much might try and switch the probes or maybe try to put them in different ports. Um, whereas obviously someone who knows exactly what they're doing similarly just going to take the dial and turn it up and get an accurate measurement, right? And so that's really how the assessment more looks. Um, but I think from this, you'll have gotten a pretty good understanding of exactly how this simulation can be used to judge electrical aptitude of any job candidates that come your way, um, specifically their ability to use a multimeter at a pretty basic level. So if you're interested in becoming a development partner and helping us customize this situation to, spe to specific situations, reach out to me. You can send me an email at eric at skillcatapp.com and I look forward to talking to you more about it. Have a good one, guys.